My name is Harry Balfani. I'm an artist, and I'm not a politician. But like most Americans, I have a great interest in the political and the economic destiny of my country. I'm sitting here with Senator Jack Kennedy. As a Negro and as an American, I have many questions, and I'm sure everyone does, about civil rights, about foreign policy, about the economy of the country, and about things that will happen. And I want to make it very clear, Harry, that on this question of equality of opportunity for all Americans, whether it's in the field of civil rights, better minimum wages, better housing, better working conditions, jobs, I stand for these things. The Democratic Party under Franklin Roosevelt stood for them. I'm voting for this thing. How about you? Vote for a leader like Roosevelt. Vote for John F. Kennedy for president, 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 president. All right, so say for example, if that was one piece, and then we bring in Ginsburg, who you know, sort of was the poet art of the beat scene, but we fast forward to hip hop. I definitely just want to do that as a little improvisation. And imagine, you know, this kind of notion of storytelling and the way the beat poets were trying to figure out how to innovate with language, whether it was Mary Baraka, Jack Kerouac, or of course Ginsburg, um, and Williams Burroughs' cut-up technique. All of that has distilled out of the beat poetry of that era to the rhythms of a re relentless electronic minimalist era of our hip-hop, techno, drum and bass, and all these new storm forms of storytelling. 